Okay, it's Mark. Um, I'm back again. I'm just doing a really quick video. I'm just, I've been asked a few a couple of questions. People have messaged me about my vlogging kit and what I use. So I'm going to just quickly go through that um, and just show you what I use. Um, as you all know now, um, I use a DJI Pocket to do a lot of my filming. So um, I use this for vlogging when it's face to face like this. And I also, also use it to get a little bit of B-roll. So I'm just going to quickly run through the accessories that I use. The first one, um, which comes as a, an accessory kit with um, the DJI, um, and this is the wireless adapter. So this fits on back at the bottom of the pocket, and it means you can connect to your phone wirelessly. So you can control the pocket, put it down, control it, and then, you know, walk away and control it with the phone. This unfortunately doesn't have a tripod mount, so you can buy a little adapter like this, pretty cheap, but it has got um, a tripod mount, so all you do is, this just slides in, and away you go, you can put it onto a tripod and walk away. The second thing that I, I bought as part of the accessory kit was the DJI control uh, wheel. Again, this just fits onto the pocket and it just gives you a bit more fine tuning with the wheel, and it has a couple of um, buttons as well. Yeah, it has a couple of buttons as well. Yeah, so, okay. What else? Um, when I am vlogging, I... I mean, this is great. You know, you can have this and turn it to front, you know, to face you and, and do it. you've got a little screen at the front of the pocket. But it, it's not ideal um, if you want... Um, something a bit sturdier to hold. So I did a bit of investigating as I do on uh, YouTube and I found this. I think this is this is the Polar Pro grip system for it. And as you can see, it's quite a sturdy piece of kit. Yeah. And what it, how it works is you it comes with a little cage and they call this a tripod, um, I think they call it a tripod mount because um, it has got a standard fitting at the bottom to screw onto a tripod. But what you do is you open it up, you fit your pocket in, lock it, yeah, so that's locked, and then all it does is slides in and then this little screw tightens it up so it can't move. It's a bit filled around it went there go. Yep, so it tightens it up. And what you've got now is the pocket in a grip. So if I turn it on. Yep. So yeah. So as you can see the little screen at the back and then what you do is you get the pocket comes with the phone adapter this is a lightning one for an iPhone and um, what you do then is pop that into the little slot on the pocket like that and then your phone fits into here yep yeah, so it fits in and then and then if you switch the pocket on and download the app what it'll do there it's brought the app straight up and you can see there look so the DJI camera is facing me and what you can do then is you control you can control all the settings on your phone yeah so a really good piece of kit what I then decided is I mean the mic on the um, pocket is not bad 
but I wanted something more. Um, so I looked at the road video mic, micros and all that and then I went on YouTube one day and Joby popped up with a sponsored thing about uh, their new microphone. So I did a bit of research and this is it. Yeah, and it's the um, Joby Wavo. They do two versions. They do a really smaller version. Um, I think that's, I don't know what that one's for. I looked on Amazon and for some reason Amazon was selling them half price. So instead of being £70, they were selling them for £34, I think. Um, I thought it was a mistake, but anyway, it turned up a couple of days later. So what I do now is on this grip system by Polar Pro, it's got standard, I think, the, is it three quarter fittings? And so it's got one there, um, one at the bottom, and then one at the bottom of there. And so what I use these for now, I bought these little adapters as well, other thing to make it male and male, so that fits in and then you can just screw things to it. So what I decided to do is, is, is attach a microphone to this system. Um, I do it, attach it underneath, so it's just as straightforward as that. Unfortunately, the um, the pocket only uses uh, as one connection, and that's the USB C. Um, and what you've got to do with DJI is buy their uh, USB C uh, microphone adapter. They do they ask third party ones, but I've got I've, I've heard that they don't work. So uh, I mean, this is quite expensive, but it's a godsend. So all you do then is at the bottom of the DJI is plug it in. The Wavo comes with two cables. It comes for one that works with mobile phones and it comes with another that works for DSLRs or cameras. Um, I think it's something to do with the um, number of rings on the connectors. Um, there's a technical term but I don't know what it is but yeah th this one it's got um, two black rubber rings um, the other ones that come, I've got three, but for this to work you need the one that has got two. So all you do is plug into your adapter, like that. And then plug it into the back of your mic. And then what it does is, um, it, the pocket knows that you've got the adapter but, uh, plugged in. And it'll turn off the internal mic on the pocket and then everything goes through to the uh, external microphone and it, it, it does sound a lot better. You can tell by my last video on the unboxing when I went from the um, Joby microphone to the uh, GoPro internal microphone looking above, the, there is a difference. So yeah, so that's that. I mean it still looks bulky to say that the pocket's only here but it's, uh, I, I do like it. So, um, what else? Uh, me being me, I already have a couple of the Loom Cubes. This is the 2.0 and I also have the Loom Cube Air. So I decided then to um, put this on as well. I have used it with this on and I'm quite, I am quite like it. The reason I'm using the 2.0 is because I've got the um, band doors and filters on here as well. Um, I'm gone for the air. And all this does again using this here is it just screws on. So, if I were to put the air on, so you can see, yeah, so I'm just going to um, swap over to um, the pocket now, just so you can uh, see what I mean. Um, I'm going to keep this camera running, um, but I'm going to film myself um, on this one. So bear me one moment, I need to put the uh, filter in because it's blinding me. So if I put the filter on, this is just a, a normal diffuser. Yeah. So, um, 
I'm just going to, as you can see, I'm going to turn it to myself on the screen. Yeah. And then I'm going to I'm going to just record myself. So I've got it in auto, um, and I'm just going to record. So this is um, using the DJI Pocket. Yeah. Um, I'm going to change mode, so I'm going to put it onto follow mode, which means I can tell it to follow me. So if I move the uh, the gimbal pocket, follows me. Yeah. If I duck down. Yeah. So this so this is using the um, external Joby microphone and also um, the Loom Cube. Um, which works really well. Uh, I mean, as you can see there, I'll just change mode again and I'm going to put it on to just to change it to fast. Oh, it picked me up. So yeah, so it is quite cool. Um, yeah. So I'll switch that back off now, and I'll go back to you. Um, but yeah. So that's my that's my whole um, vlogging setup. Yeah. And I keep it all. Yeah, and I keep it all in in just um, a little carry case. The other thing that I got is um, an extension rod. Uh, again, this is just for the pocket in a mobile phone, but again, it's okay for when you wanting to do some sort of, you know, away, and if you use it with a wireless um, can, thing at the bottom of the thing and connect it with your phone, then it's fine. Um, quite a useful piece of kit, I've used it a couple of times. The other thing I've, I've got um, is some filters as well. Um, these are by PGY Tech, um, and the reason I got these was to... Um, so I can use them outside during the day and show the, and, and slow the shut speed down. Um, so I can shoot 4K and things like that. So I've I haven't, I've only used them once. Uh, they're a bit fiddly. Um, I've got the ND ones and I've also got um, a polarizing one as well. Um, so these four in the corners are, are the ND and then the one in the middle is a polarizer. So I think when we can get out more I'm gonna try these. So um that's my um kit, my vlogging kit. Um I've still got the camera I'm filming on here which is the Sony WX five hundred or something like that. Um and I do use that for things like this. But when I'm doing handheld then this um, packs away quite small and you know it gives me gives me good light good good audio um, yeah good audio if I wanted it any smaller then I could just use a pocket on its own or I could use a pocket with a wireless um, adapter at the bottom and just do it that way um, but I think it's going to be handy for b-roll Anyway, so that's just a really quick rundown of my uh, my vlogging kit. So thank you for listening. Please hit the like button and please hit the subscribe button. One thing you'll notice about my most of my vlogs, they're all in one take. I don't do any chopping or, or changing or cutting this and things like that. It is just one take. I just find it easier that way. So yeah, thank you.